Okay, welcome back to Carlos RC. Okay, we finally came in the FSR Sniper. So I haven't opened it yet, so let's get into it. Real quick unboxing, I don't normally do these, but I just want to have a look at this beast. Now, there's a reason this beast is up here as well, is because that this will be my second FSR. Straight away, strike that red is just striking. All right, let's have a look what we get in the box. Some servo horns, some tools, stickers, manual. Transmitter will be here. I have I have had some experience with these transmitters, obviously with that one there. Now this is this is a gyro. This does have a gyro now. I believe uh, from memory on how to access the gyro, you've got to press this maybe four times, and then the steering jewel rate. You can adjust how much the lights LEDs will light up here, and you can adjust how much gyro you can do from that. Not a bad transmitter. They do the job, but I will be hooking it up to something else. All right, let's get to the meat and potatoes of this. Oh yes, that red body. Nothing else in the box. Check that out. I really hope that's coming through. Look how wicked that looks. Really, really cool. Now the tires, they look they nice and firm and they kind of remind me of um, MT Pioneers. Okay, so the just first spinning of that, the diffs loose, loose as. So they're probably just uh, grease filled, or barely filled at all. Okay, so there's the light switch for the other, uh, LEDs at the front. Is there a back one? I'm not sure. Okay, so there is a what is that 3652 2500 kV motor hobby wing 3s don't know why they use Dean's connectors I'll be chopping that off putting an XT90 on it nice it's got a heat sink on it some of the it feels a little sloppy in the front I mean you definitely need to go over it I mean, there's no play in the diffs. I'm just checking there that they, they seem shimmed up all right. Yep, shimmed up all right. Nice beefy dog bone. Well, not beefy, but the, I mean, beefy enough, I guess. In the back, what are they at the front? CVD, yeah, CVD's at the front. Hope you can all see this. Yep. Let's have a look underneath. That's interesting. <laughs> a lot of screws holding that. At least they're using... Uh, Allen keys or hex heads. Yeah, looks good. Nice beefy arms. Jeez, really nice beefy arms. Pillar ball suspension. Let's see what the shocks feel like. Feels, feels alright. Doesn't feel too bad at all. Has it got troop screws? No. Hoping for a lot of set. Oh, it's all right. Oh, that, that, that actually sits all right. It's not uh, sagging too much. Nice uh, stiff tail to tail brace there. That's nice. What I will do is hook the Hobby Wing program card into this. Hopefully, there's a spot. Yeah, it should be able to hopefully plug it into there. And I might be able to get the card reader on that and adjust a few settings. I don't know yet. I will check the mesh, take that off, I'll check the mesh after, but guys, I like, I'm like. i liking what I see, just the diffs, that's all, they just need to be filled appropriately, but this is, this is a good size, this is actually a really, really nice size, that body, how cool does that look, 
Yes, it does look like something else from another brand. But hey, it's got body clip retainers on there. Wicked. All right, let's let's have a look at what it looks like next to this big behemoth here. All right, so there's a <laughs> there is a size difference, but this is a pretty good size for a one tenth. I'm liking it. I really like it. It's low slung to the ground. The body doesn't feel too flimsy. It feels all right. I mean, I'll, I'll still do the normal gorilla tape thing that I'll do on everything. But yeah, look at that. Two FSRs in my collection now. That is an incredible machine, but we're here to talk about this one. All right. Loving it. Looks wicked. I cannot wait to give this a first rip. Is that plastic I'm seeing there? Yeah, just a little bit of plastic from the body. I'll take that off after. That that red is wicked looking. All right. Can't wait to get this out. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed that little unboxing from me. I don't, like I said, I don't normally do these, but just had to for this. This is incredible. All right. Thanks for watching Chaos RC. Don't forget to subscribe too, guys.